Walking in the city of Colombo can be a great way to explore and experience the vibrant atmosphere of Sri Lanka's capital. Here are some suggestions for a walking tour of Colombo. Peta Market. If you're in Colombo, make sure to head towards Peta, the bustling commercial district. Explore the vibrant market streets filled with shops selling spices, textiles, jewelry, and various other goods. Firstly, visit Malwatha Street, formerly known as Front Street if you want to purchase travel bags, pouches, travel accessories, shoes, sandals, etc. We'll now look at First Cross Street where you can find electronic items. Lighting items like bulbs, lampshades, chandeliers, mobile phones and accessories, mobile and electronic repair centers, electrical appliances and more. Next, we come to Second Cross Street. Peta is a hub for textiles, with numerous shops selling fabrics, saris, batik clothing, and traditional garments, and even curtain material. If you're looking for affordable options, Peta is a great place to shop for fabrics and clothing. And now, off Second Cross Street, you will find Malaban Street. You can get your own customized wedding cards, greeting cards, and any type of cards printed for your family and friends occasions with an affordable price. As we walk down 2nd Cross Street again, we can see that the vendors here are covering their items because it's about to rain. Once you further walk down 2nd Cross Street and cut across Main Street, you will find the Red Mosque, also called Jami Ul Alfar Mosque. Make a stop at the Red Mosque, a striking landmark known for its unique architecture and vibrant red and white striped exterior. After passing the Red Mosque, you will find Bankshall Street, where you can buy plastic flowers, flower pots, plastic plants, Christmas decorations, etc. And you can also find chemical products for home-based industries, SME. When you further go down Bankshall Street, you spot the Gold Market Building. On its second floor, you can buy fishing gear such as fishing rods, lines, hooks, and nets. For anything related to fishing, you know where to go. Now we come towards Dam Street. Here you can find kitchen and restaurant items from pots and pans to cutlery and baking materials. Good for locals who are planning to start a restaurant or cafe business. You can find all essentials for cooking, baking, etc. for a cheap and affordable price. Then we come to China Street, where you find lots of birthday gift items. Birthday party decorations, plastic cups, plates, food containers to buy in bulk for restaurants or cafes with a reasonable price. Now we fall onto Main Street. Here you can find shops mainly selling traditional ladies' clothes like saris, shalwa kameez, and more. For spices, visit 3rd Cross Street in Peta. It is known for having aromatic and flavorful spices. You can find a variety of spices like cinnamon, cardamom, cloves, nutmeg, and more. Be sure to buy from reputable shops to ensure good quality. It's always a good idea to shop with trusted vendors and compare prices before making a purchase. 
Be mindful of traffic while walking in the city and be aware of your surroundings. We have come to the end of this video. I hope this guide helps you as a tourist or local. Make sure to subscribe to my channel for more informative videos like this. Hit the like button and put your notifications on. Thank you.